guys, Miss Charlie here with an unboxing. I have the Unearthly Cosmetics Halloween box uh, for 2023. Um, and I'm going to open it and show you what's in the box. I'm doing this on my floor because I didn't. my desk is not big enough for this box. It's very pretty. It has um, Venus fly traps on it, if you can see them. And the Unearthly logo in like a holographic which is really pretty so I like this box so I might keep these things in the box and just display it not so I don't have to worry about space as to where to put it I'm just gonna keep it in the box but it's magnetized in the front and that's how it looks when I open it this is the top part here where it says unearthly with the Venus fly traps and then under here is the palette, highlighter palette, and these are liquid lipsticks and two lip glosses in this. This is so nice. I like how this came. It didn't come like individual or in a box where it's just randomly, you know, stuff in there. I like the way this is packaged. That's why I said I'm going to keep it in this box because this will be perfect for storage and then I can just set this up on a shelf or whatnot and it's it's out of the way but um, I wanted to open this on my floor where I have more room and then I'm going to show you the different things in here um, on my desk where I have a little bit well, so I have a little bit more more room for that and I will just hand swatch the lip glosses and the highlighter and then I'll also show you swatches of the eyeshadow palette but let's go ahead and get started with that okay so i made a mistake there's a lip oil three satin lipsticks and two lip glosses so i said four um lipsticks and there's a lip oil so this is the collection the cover is beautiful this young lady here in this venus fly trap is absolutely gorgeous the artwork is stunning I love Unearthly's um, artwork on their palettes and their packaging. It's always so unique and so beautiful. So I'm just going to start with the lippies first and then we'll work our way to the eyeshadow palette. I'm going to start with the lip oil and this is the Devour collection if I didn't mention that. And this is what the packaging looks like. And this is in the color Ruin can see that but it's in the color ruin and this is so pretty it looks like a crystal and it's got some weight to it it's really pretty it's almost like a blood red color and I like a good lip oil so this will be used it smells good it smells a little like a little sweet but not too much and it does not have much color to it which is fine because it's a lip oil and one application will do both will do your lips you don't have to dig back in there which is good because I don't like to have to go back in and get more product this will do and it's a nice thick oil but not heavy not heavy on my hand anyway but you can see what the color is supposed to look like like a blood red but there's like no color on my skin tone now if I had a fairer skin tone there might be but this doesn't really have a color which is fine so that is the lip oil in ruin and we have the lip glosses again it's the same packaging this one is in havoc and this one is in predator I love predator predator between Predator and Jason, I mean, come on, I will take them both, but I love me some Predator. And this is like a duochrome, um, it's like green and burgundy and a little gold. I don't know if you can see the color changing there, it's so pretty. It's got some purple in it as well.
that's so pretty yes I love a multi chrome and dual chrome lip because I will just make it out of the dual chromes and multi chromes that I have but yes this will be used very very much it'll show the shift that is so pretty so pretty so yes this will be used very very much and that one is in predator and then the one in havoc is more of a pink with sparkles in it it's got some gold sparkles, a little peach and pink in there. See a little bit of purple. And that's what she looks like there. Very sparkly. Oh my God, that's so pretty. That is so pretty. It's nice to add some new lippies to my collection. I don't really buy a lot of lippies, but this is so pretty. It's got gold and green and pink and purple. So pretty, so pretty. So that one was in Havoc. So those were the two lip glosses now for the satin liquid lipsticks again same packaging this one is in chomp this one is in yummy and this one is in a destroy destroy is like a nude it's a cool tone nude But it's got some gray in it. It's like a gray neutral brown. Oh yes. Yes. That is pretty. On camera it's coming off a little bit more cooler toned gray. But to me it is like a warmer toned gray brown this oh my gosh yes thank you thank you thank you for this color I am excited to use it and this one is in destroy yummy is a green and I have been mixing colors in my collection to make different greens so if you have things in your collection you don't really have to buy it you can mix what you have And this is pretty, really pretty. I like that green. Kind of reminds me of the one that I have from um, Crayon Case, but theirs is a little bit more vibrant. And I will have to check this formula to see how it is because the Crayon Case one is really drying, so I have to mix it with a gloss or it will crack and peel off. So I will see how these work, but these look beautiful. On my hand so we'll see how they look on my lips but that one is in yummy and then lastly we have predator which is like a mauvey brown it's like a mauvey brown with some blood red in there a little bit oh my goodness gracious that is freaking gorgeous. It's like a dark grape wine burgundy. Oh my God. Kind of reminds me of Queen of the Night from Kaleidos, which is darker and more wine colored. But this one, oh my God. These three, I cannot wait to put these on my lips. So next we're going to open the um, blush and highlighter. I can open it here. 
same as the packaging beautiful and this is the blush in slay and the highlight in delicate so pretty and we'll swatch these oh that's gorgeous this would be a nice eyeshadow I'll use that as a highlighter so here's delicate and then slay it's a nice blush you will need a just a tiny bit of that but slay not slay um delicate is very delicate but it is a little sparkly so this would be a nice topper or inner corner highlight or you can wear this all over the lid both of these on the lid would be absolutely a beautiful so that is the highlighter palette then lastly we have the devour eyeshadow palette and I will put I will insert swatches of this again there's the outside same as the packaging with our lady um venus fly trap and there is the color story it is dark vampy and beautiful this color gruesome is like a purple with gold in it like a dual chrome instinct is a beautiful teal demolish is like a pink lavender beautifulness ravage is like a red oh and this red here devour we're gonna see how she is because i love a good red i love a good green i like the difference in the greens right here lots of greens and then snack can't tell without swatching it what it is or bite but it looks like this one This one has a blue undertone. This one's gonna have more of a green gold undertone. You can see the shifts of those. Because to me they look white, but they're not. And then trap, of course we have to have that in there. Venus fly trap, that's gonna be a gold to green. It's got a little teal in it. see those shifts a little bit in there and I like that it has this dark greeny black but yeah I will insert swatches of this palette so you can see them and also check out my Instagram because I will have um, swatches there too as well as like more swatches in motion so you can see the different shifts and whatnot but this is a beautiful palette and I'm sorry it looks more washed out because trap looks a little lighter on camera than it does it, it looks totally different in person as well as snack and bite but I can't wait to use this I will be doing probably a two looks using these products coming up soon but I am so glad that I got this collection because um, I think they do this every year and this is the year that I decided to just go ahead and uh, jump right in and grab it. Um, but but yeah, I am glad that I oops, turn this around. I'm glad that I got this. I am excited to try out these lip glosses and this. I have on the lip the lip um, oil. I did put on the lip oil, and it is very nice. It's thick. It's not going to come off. It's not like some lip oils where you put them on and then five seconds later they're gone. It's not. It's going to be on here for a while. So I'm so glad I got this collection. Let me know if you picked this up as well. And if you want to do a collab look with me, let me know. I love doing collab looks with other creators. So um, let me know your thoughts on this collection. Make sure to follow me on Instagram and follow me here on YouTube. I thank you all. I appreciate you all for coming. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.